The Mesha inscription is that which was inscribed by the Moabite king Mesha and found on the Mesha steel, an inscription on black basalt stella from approximately 835 BCE. According to Bean and Rolston, the Mesha steel, written in the Moabite language, a northwest Semitic dialect closely related to Biblical Hebrew, presents itself as the same Mesha, I, Mesha, king of Moab, as the Moabite king found in 2 Kings 3, 4. Now, King Mesha of Moab was a sheep breeder who used to deliver to the king of Israel 100,000 lambs and the wool of 100,000 rams. Both the steel and the books of Joshua through 2 Kings agree that Moab was subjugated by Israel and that Mesha eventually threw off the Israelite yoke. Judges, too, can, as Hayes points out, serve as a kind of condensed summary of the biblical historian's view of the nation's fortunes throughout the Deuteronomistic history, the story of Israel and Judah. We see a pattern of divine anger and mercy in the repeated cycles of human apostasy, leading to divine anger slash abandonment, followed by human distress, and followed by divine deliverance. A key theological similarity is that both the Mesha inscription and the biblical text speak of a God revealed as Yahweh in the Bible who acts in history. We also see similarities in the view that there is only one God, with worship being restricted to that one God, although the Mesha inscription indicates monolatry, the worship of one God without denial of the existence of other gods, rather than monotheism, as Yahweh instructs and the Bible affirms throughout.